this one's probably going to be over fast. Sammy on the left, Paul on the right, playing. I did put it in brackets, turbo discard, because I don't think There's it's quite built right. Guy in Paul's deck, I think, purely for these matchups, I'm guessing. <laughs> yeah, and uh, yeah, Paul is also on the stern and. Uh, but a slightly different build. Yeah, exactly. I think built probably the worst of the, the, the builds that we've seen so far. We probably won't see... He's got a like, Chocobo Sam in it and things yeah, as well. But... We, we probably won't see Fat Chocobo getting you five cards, but oh, three... Is this is an Ice Wind deck from Sammy. Not really. I think he's just included Riku. This is a this is a banned card, though. Um, it is. So let's see it. Put the top card of, uh, of their deck basically into the break zone, I think, right? Uh, uh, no. You... Tap, we pay wind and tap to do that. Yeah, uh, and then was it put two for the yes. as effect? You make them mill two and you draw. Yeah, so we have gone straight in with a Laswell for trying to get the the discards off. But again, Joker will get much louder than that. Uh, that Laswell. Yes, that Laswell is probably not long for this world. No, but again. Izana searching Fat Chocobo. Fat Chocobo's probably going to get you three cards. I think in Paul's deck, consistency is about three. Yeah, exactly. And that's good enough. It pays for itself. And yeah, I mean, if you hit three, you've gone even. Yeah. And here it is. Let's count them out. One, One two, two, three. three. No. 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 Double, oh, double stole again. The that's bottom, pretty good for Sammy there. Yeah. Because that will be pretty mean to try yeah, and get that's, past. That's paid for itself there. Yeah. But now we can like Chocobo the fat Chocobo back, right? And go again. <laughs> Chocobo Sam coming in. Uh, no, because I think the Chocobo only targets Fords. Ah, uh, okay. You think I'd know this since it's not something that's... I, if that targeted backups, that would not be okay. <laughs> that's why Althea is banned. Because uh, that was not I okay. I could target character. Yeah. Uh, um, so up to three backups. Which is perfectly fine. Because you shuffle to pass turn now. Yeah, now you're you're more than happy. Oh, you want to attack on that as well? I'll crash, no problem. Mm -hmm. I'd rather play in his island. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Play another one. Sure. Now Paul just really needs to hit his Cleo, uh, Mion, sorry, and uh, Mion and Bismarck. Yeah, and he's kind of got everything and, he needs. Can we just no? Oh, there we go. Ruggedy. Which is not stirring. No, it's a rug. But it does mean. So we can, bigger. Yeah, which means we're going to get the discard off the attack, which is pretty nice, actually. So, so the first attack from Rug. Oh, and he hits a Chocobo off the top. Uh, there Grabbing we go. Stern, I guess. Stern, yeah. <laughs> what a damage for Paul McAvoy. Never punished. Um, Swing, Laswell. I think you've got to just... Does that Laswell not have Brave? Uh, I'm not sure, because Sammy wasn't really using Rug to his greatest effect earlier, but... I guess he didn't. Oh, uh, discard. Hold up. Discard. Laswell. <laughs> oh, it's weird being on the outside. I don't like this. Ah, uh, switch again. <laughs> Whole new setup. It feels weird. I know. No, next time we're going back against the wall. Yeah. I don't like my head being under this light. <laughs> I look ethereal. I'm too white for this. So I think Stern has to come in here, right? Oh, absolutely. Like. You've got no problems making your guys much bigger this, than this card making LB cheaper as well. Yes, is so yes. again, Paul used this in a friendly against me earlier and cast Ace for seven, killed my board, felt sad. Like, oh, that's a cool rug you've got there, but all of my stuff gets 4k bigger, so yeah. like, exactly, doesn't matter. Or you just don't let the rug attack and you just remove four twice and deal twice. 14 you know at yeah, the moment Paul can't do but he's building up so what's uh same thing is that two Tharmaturges I think he has in hand oh well discard two right off the bat would be pretty nice again though does discard really work against Paul because Stern <laughs> I think it does so discard well, Tharmaturge for Tharmaturge gets rid of a second Stern yeah which is perfectly fine I think the only thing these cards are lacking is probably Stern is an S <laughs> Let's not bring any more hatred onto the world. Mm. It can be unbanned, right? It's going every day. Oh, just could. Let's let's just not do that. So, bringing in surges dead. here to dull stone. Yeah, which is stops him being a blocker for Laswell. Yeah, because you're gonna bump. You could bump him up anyway to block most of the board. 
This is true. This is true. I'm not sure if this is like the best use of, of the CP here, but no, but it's what's happened. Yeah. So what's the decision making? I mean, Rug has to swing. Um, yeah, because it's still going to be bigger than the well, what? rug. I would just put like <coughs> haste and brave on surges and first strike on Laswell. You uh, have three attackers. I mean, to to be honest, I'd probably just put it all on the Laswell. Um, yeah, and then on the stack, we're going to shoot it. Absolutely not. Stern says no. And there goes Bismarck. Bismarck. So we're up to damage three already. Three to nothing. Yeah, Sammy holding on here. But uh, so what's that? So that's another stern. Oh, that. Mion. Well, there's my own. Let's get back that. Fat job will draw. The Let fact she draws you a card as well. Oh no! Can wait, 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 wait. Oh wow, that's not. Hang on, I need to check that Jogobo out. Has Paul made a mistake there? With. Uh, is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? So many Jogobos. Why is there so many card named Chocobos? Which uh, joke were you looking, thinking of? The, the one he could have played that usually plays a Chocobo. Is it this one? Yes. So choose one card named Chocobo. Uh, card named Chocobo from your hand onto the field. Why wouldn't he play? Oh, no, it's because Fat, fat Chocobo. Yeah, it's not, yeah, fat it's not job. Okay, sure. I thought that was something that could have been missed there, but... Um, I missed how much he got off of that then. I think it was... Three by the looks of things. Oh, no. No, this three is from the other choke, but it's just the summon choke away just cast. Ah, okay. So I think he got two or three from the fat choke away replay. Um, still, this is building a board pretty quick. And he's back up to more cards than what he had in his hand at the beginning of the mm -hmm. turn, so. Oh, there so we go. Comes that one that plays this, this one. Yeah, so that's the one that makes things bigger on the party attack. Yep. Uh, he doesn't have the backup one that lets you party of any element, or does he? It doesn't really I think he does. matter, because you could just party with the Azana. They both gain 4k more. And then if he decides to block with the rug, you just buff them by 4. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is... This is quite scary for Sammy, because he's, he's down to none in hand as well. Yeah, exactly. And discard doesn't help when you can just... Muller out a load of cards from your deck like it's nothing. So uh, I'm going to make you mill. Okay. okay. <laughs> yeah. Thanks. I, Ammunition for yeah, stirring. <laughs> great. Oh god. Well, I think we're going to try and trick Sammy into a block here. I think he. Nah. He you... can block. But he has to block with smaller things. Oh, and losing a Gasper. Gasper. Oof. That's a good hit. I think that's the only attack Paul does this turn, though. Yeah, again, you could party, but I don't think you want to give up your your chocobos in deck yet. Uh, sorry, in, in break zone, sorry. So, just waiting to see a Bismarck now so that fat chocobo just loops continuously. Yeah. <clears throat> well, well, Sammy is going through the decision-making, guys. Tell us your favourite bank card, because no one's chatting. I feel sad. Bid loss for another mm -hmm. as well, so dull and freezing stone. Yeah, yeah. And here we go again. We're going to give it all to the Surges. So did you shoot the stir Sturges? The Sturges? The Surges on the stack? I mean, to, to, fine with it. I mean, probably getting rid of the last well isn't terrible. We can't attack this turn. No, but... You I can always do that your next turn. I think that's why... Yeah, shooting the Surges on, yeah. the, on the stack. I'm not sure if that's kind of a waste, to be honest. Uh, the attack from the rug coming through, then? Mm, nope, we're going to block with the Azana. Yeah. I mean, you want forwards in your break zone, right? Yeah, not only that, you want to play those Azanas again, get more Chocobos. So. Hmm. Oh. Thaumaturge so, is only 1k? No, he's 5. Oh, is it 2 or less? Yeah. Ah. Another chunk block gives a... That's, that's why Thaumaturge was silly. 1 drop 5k discards something, like, pretty much. Um. Yeah, but, you know, it's fun. <laughs> it, is, it is that. It is that. That's why we're doing it. Um, so well cannot live out this turn, I think. Yeah. Hey, Paul, thank you for joining us. And yeah, Dadaluma. Very surprised we've not had a Dadaluma deck this uh, this day. 
Not that Ginny the... had it, but I think that's the only deck that's probably running it today. Yeah. yeah. But again, you'd, you'd want to see a proper, like, Wind Earth, Dadaluma build with the Cactuars. Cactuars and, yeah. yeah. Um, I do love the idea of it being in there with, uh, with the walls so that you get the pings off of... Uh, or Faris or four colour wall because yeah. you can obviously ping any forward. Yeah. So. So Paul's got a lot to to mull through here. I'm not oh, really sure. Problem is though, is that is that is that is that there we get there in the end. There's double stern. Like he's got one in his hand as well. It's also he doesn't have a major answer to the rug because yeah. he's never able to get enough to shoot it twice. No. That's it. That's I think why Paul was just trying to bait Sammy into the block. Mm -hmm. Um. It'll be... Oh, we're going with Ace. Ace. Right, now we don't get to see Ace cast all that often. So that's... Uh, so is this... it 2k for each? No, oh, 1k. Is it enough to kill everything, though? I don't think it is. It does it 6k. Is. Now we shoot the rug. There yeah, we go. and then we move forward. Bye-bye, rug. We had the new year. Riku S is pretty good. good. The problem is, is that again, Sammy's played this Riku into the back of this line. This is quite good for Paul here as well because he knows where all of his stones are. So Ace is always getting you a card now as well. Yeah. And Sammy with nothing but one back up on field is kind of stuck. Yeah. Is Dane coming in? Steal what a card. What are we going to steal? Ooh. It's a backup. Although, to be honest, you can't play. Oh, Paul as well. Oh, that card is fun. What does that do? When it hits your opponent. They mill five cards. What? Yep. This thing is Paul disgusting. cannot be blocked by a forward of three or more. When Paul deals damage to your opponent, your opponent puts the top five. Why is this never... Why have I never seen this before? Because it costs uh, two. It's 4k and dies to wall. It, well, it, yeah, I suppose. It, it never gets to attack. Yeah, but Zidane can... sees play and that dies to wall. Yeah, but Zidane has haste. Yeah, but it also does it. It still has a card entry. So yeah. Bismarck coming in here. Now this is good because in theory we probably take back the Chocobo at end of turn and then now I have to check Bismarck's word in here whether it's a mandatory trigger at the end I of think turn. it's you choose up to one. Uh, well, nope. Yeah, choose up to one. So if Paul forgets then tough. Oh, he hasn't forgotten there's a fat check there in the end. Nope, there we go. <laughs> yep. Absolutely. I glance quickly back to the Mon Fear and I'm like, oh, there's it, three backups there. Did he take that with the Mion, though, instead? Because that wasn't there before, oh. right? Hmm? The Patrick, though? It's been no, there no, no, the Mion, sorry. The Mion's been there for a while. Oh, uh, okay, okay. That's fine. Well, either way... The Mion was the first bounce of the Patrick, yeah, yeah. did, yeah. Well, what do you do here, Sammy? Oh, we're going with little Leela. I... not going to live out the day. <laughs> It almost sounded a bit Lord of the Rings as well. Let's hope they last the night. <sighs> Great films. Great. Great. Oh, I love Lord of the Rings. Favourite film trilogy of all oh, time. The best film trilogy. Absolutely. <laughs> Could not agree more. Um, so what are we doing here? Oh, two we're shooting. Two. So dulling for, for dealing 2k. Uh, so much going on. I can't keep up. I'm really not sure what's Oh, happening. so, right. We tap the Chocobo. Deal two to Little Leela. Chocobo to return Chocobo to hand. Oh, okay. Draw a card. We're playing Chocobo. So many Chocobos, I can't keep up. Yeah, this is a stack that I'm getting lost with, but I Don't trust worry. them I'm, to I'm, know what they're doing. I'm kind of with it. Um, so we've added a Ishtola to hand. Yep. 7k now to the Little Leela to finish it off. It's just as a Dane left on board. Yeah, and now we're and that was all the end of Sammy's. E <laughs> yeah, welcome to Stern Leonis, everyone, everybody. Okay. Right. So, do we go Fat Chogobo? Let's go dig in first. It looks well, you like you have to. Yeah, it looks like we do. Paul has no forwards in the deck, uh, in the break zone at all, though. Thing is, if he can get one thing that has haste, he wins the t now. Yeah. Mion going. Yeah, absolutely fine. So, start flipping. Nothing. One. Mm. Two, three, yeah. come on. There's four. That's wow. a chocobo, I don't know which one. Then. That is a lot of good chocobos. Um, there's just just so many chocobos. I, I think I've said chocobos tonight more times than tonight, in my entire yeah. life. So, uh, so what's coming in now? <clears throat> all of the bows. 
You can't it's... shoot the Zidane, which is annoying. Um, I don't think that really matters. I think you just attack through now. The Bismarck for the Chocobo that plays the Chocobo. Chocobo yep. Would you play the haste one? Yep. Which plays that one. Because remember, everything on board is pretty much able to attack now. Other oh, that's than... multiplayable? Yes, oh, yes, it is God. multiplayable. Where is he? The Cloud Riding Chocobo. Because when they party together... Oh, that, that's just game then, because... Yep, there we go. Shoot that. Goodbye, Sammy. I mean, you give... Uh, yeah. You didn't even have to shoot it. You would just kill it on swing, but yeah. Yeah, yeah. Swing. yeah. There goes another ball. Chocobo comes in, given I mean, haste. That one, yeah. Yeah, and haste to finish it. Oh, it's and there's a Chocobo! Oh, what a game. Well, now you can see, guys, why these cards are banned. Now... We will have an interview with Paul McAvoy because obviously it's always good to get his insight on uh, these band cards. But I think we're also going to do one exhibition match, probably because we want to get Connor on, and we also haven't had uh, Dan Harbin on yet. So we're we can probably... ask them both. Yeah, I think so. Uh, just so that we can see. Apparently, because Guido is in use, and we all want to see why Guido's <laughs> banned. So, guys, stick with us for a little bit longer. We will be back with you very shortly. Yep. See you soon. And here he is. This is nice. Yeah, it's nice. <laughs> it looks alright, doesn't it? Production value. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, winner of round three there, Stern Leonis, piloted by Paul McLean. It's not okay. It's not okay. No. It's not Can't okay. come back? No. <laughs> Everything we've seen tonight is not okay. I, 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 so, we, we've, we've had a chat around things about tables there. Some people say Thormaturge can come back. I no. say no. no. Um, <laughs> some people say, oh, Dalum is okay. And that's, that's more one of, it's one of the better ones, but like, I still, I still think that it enables too much, and I, I think that if it's on there, if, if it's on there for the time that it, you know that it was, mm. like things haven't gone better. No, <laughs> things are, there's more options now with that. So the the problem is though with like Dada Luma is like you compare it to like Faris, um, and there's only a one k difference, but Faris does way more. But Faris enables Dada Luma. Oh no! Absolutely, yeah, so, like, yeah, we were we were gutted that Jenny had to go against Jacob because we saw that she had Dada Luma in the deck. And and we, we didn't get to see it. Yeah, 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 and it would have been awesome to see. But again, Turbo Discard is yeah, that, it's, that it's, Thormatuge yeah. isn't like the fact you could if you start with three in hand, you make your opponent. Discard you play four three. of them though. Yeah. You play Argath as well. Yeah, like, yeah we saw that. I and mean, you've got the Lufenian back up now as well. It was just it's it's, it's, it's basically silly. show us on the doll where the deck touched you. <laughs> like it's not okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pockets. Um, I'm doing. So I mean, yeah, it's it's been fun to to get uh, Stearns back in the deck and just like uh, sort of like you know remember why this was a thing was say, before my time. I I <laughs> yeah. was really hoping because of the sort of uh, deck that Kitty used to play uh, with Vestale and oh Stern yeah, Leonis. sure, that would have been a good one to see. Cause, make uh, all your five drops cost four. Yeah. yeah. It was, uh, we've still got to put it through a lens of like today, and like obviously, aggro is always really good. It's, it's weird, like, I don't massively see um chocobos as like aggro, <laughs> it, it, it's, it technically is, but like, it's not like you know, the cat 13, like turn two, six damage sort of I thing, you, yeah. and that's because you're playing drag backups and you're drawing. I, I played a game I, with, with, with Connor who had him round one, so like, again, game one, seven oh, nothing to it. Game two, like I, I gave him too much for leeway to set up, but because of that, I got to see all the cool stuff he's got going <laughs> on in there. But um, it was like it's hard to explain, really. Like there's so much like weird stuff in there and everything, like that you can just stand the earnest for a cost of nothing on everything. It's just crazy. I, I I'd kill for a card that said make all your forge cheaper in, in a, every deck 4, I run. Four thousand power yeah. and Four brave. CP Bismarck. Do you know what? I'm I, but like I, in that game too, I played Fat Chocobo. I think we counted six times because it was just like he couldn't deal with the Bismarck and was too busy setting up. So I'm just like, yeah, cool. Just, he was like, well, he, he's like, well, out on like turn four, or time four of it. He's just like, well, you've run out of everything now. You're not going to get anything. So like, yeah, well, there's another three cards. Yep, and they're all multi Do you know what I think you missed a trick with as well, which we're also forgetting when you consider banned cards like Stern with new cards, is you could play it for free off of Cecil. In the That's just wrong. No. No, there's no space. So, um, 
the, I, I did consider it, and it's nice for the protection stuff. But there's, you know, you think about that. It's like, oh, yeah, it'd be lovely to get Yuffie in there. Because <laughs> so you, if you're playing a Bismarck thing as well, it would be lovely to get Bismarck uh, to Yuffie in there. It would be, yeah, it would be great to get Cecil in there. But like, what do you take out? Yeah. The only things that, that like, I'm not taking his arm out. Um, there's a there's a chocobo knight in there, which is just like oh, if you, you have, give that yeah. haste, that's another fat chocobo. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> so. Absolutely, and and to be honest, like I think the only other cards you've got of uh, your uh, Ishtolas, but you can't take them out either because Protection. safety. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The amount of times you do that, you know, you know that they've got the uh, the the Shantoto hand. They just go, ah, ah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I cancel that one. Yeah. The awful. one thing I liked about Stone though, and it's something that I feel like a lot of the modern cards are lacking, is it is that monster removal. You, you, that's you why know. I was just like former touch yeah, yeah <laughs> it, like if, if you had Stern no monsters ever get played ever I don't think um, just because of how frequently and easily you can do it maybe it's just yeah but the cost of nothing and you know uh, get rid of friend, four. Yeah. friend of the team friend of the channel Steve D always put it this way well, like when I think I think it was when he was lobbying for Stern to get banned it's like the price of the effects that it does it's like a 4 CP uh, and the 4K and Brave is like on a Gipol, which costs yeah. four. You know, the 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 seven K something is the Opus One Brynhilda. That's three CP in a card. Yeah. Um, the monster removal is like you know that's still Didn't a really pretty, uh, back then, no. Right? I, it was like an Alexander and yeah, things yeah. like that. So like, but it's just like all these costs that I should be paying that have cost me stuff that's in my break zone. And, right? he, and he's a 4K nine. He's a four CP nine K body. Yeah, well, well. He's, so in that game, then it was just like he went attacking. It was just like, oh well, I've only got like, two in the bin. Well, let's block twice, shall we? <laughs> it's the only way I can kill his rug. Like, <laughs> hey, at least they didn't put it on a multi element card because that is something else. They would do game. today, wouldn't yeah. they? Oh, <laughs> like yeah, we'll get we'll get a reprint of Stern at some point. Won't we? <laughs> no, I, they know better than that now. Like, I know a lot of cards these days and that we talk about quite a lot is we do want more frequent bans for the game. Mm -hmm. And I think the problem is, is a lot of people compare it to these older cards that are, uh, for, for using YYT's term, a little bit more degenerate. Mm. Um, but I still think the game is in a, a much healthier state without them and we should see more bans to go along with it. I think so. You know, it, it does keep things... Uh... It shakes them out. Well, yeah, there's this, this. I think the problem that the Hobby Japan guys seem to have is that they seem to be like embarrassed by it. There's no shame in it. Like, there's like what six thousand cards or something in it you now. You can't like, design a card in Opus Three. That no, you you can't build every future card around the fact that it might do something with this. No, exactly. But they, they should just be a bit more like, you know, every every set there should be a new band list with new stuff on it and stuff like. Uh, even even if it was just one card every set, I, I'd be happy. I, with I think it. it's that or a handful, four, five. Yeah. The three. rotated format what? needs to look be looked at further potentially. L L L three is like one in one out is bad, especially when it's only three. Yeah. We, we we did some maths some months ago, uh, and we thought that if they do want one in one out, the actual only way to do it is L four. Because L6 wasn't different enough from standard, because there's always something around it. But L4 was like this really nice sweet spot where at least you've got like yeah, because that, that's similar to the Pokemon format then, right? Where it's basically two years um, of well, the life cycle. It's sort of, but one in one out is just hmm. you know, just get rid of a year at a time. Yeah, yeah. every time that just, just have hurt. three like two two three years in, in play and then just cycle. That yeah, whole years. I, I think. If they decided at more of these like, tournaments that that's what the side events are going to be, I know a lot of the time they don't really get to pick side events, but or even if they they made it like well we're going to do you know best of three, but you have to have a second deck that is an L three deck or L four. They did that once, yeah. I think the Japan Cup a few years ago did that. It's a way of testing it as well, yeah. and you to just see need to, what the outcomes are. You need to get people invested in wanting to or having to play that game style as well. Because at the moment, everyone's like, "Well, it's just standard. I don't want to play L three. I don't want to play L 6 Why would you? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. You know, um, I bought all these cards. I want to use all these cards. But, so. And like this, you know, there's in the rotated format for Pokemon. It's like they, they, they don't do banned cards. So they have to. You wait your it's time, very, and very that stuff's rare, gone. Yeah. yeah. Um, so yeah. just. That that would be fine. Like we wouldn't mind so much about Warrior of Light and Faris. Yeah, 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 exactly. That'd be like, well, this is the game as it is right now, and when it's, it's gone, a, it's gone. This is a card that's going to continuously get better because they're going to print more things. I, I will say, like from a personal aspect, like just because of this, the last two sets have felt so samey to me. 
like it's been basically the same meta as last set and it's just repetitive it's, it's also the accessibility of the game like I came in for ages and I couldn't get hold of an Amaterasu for probably about a year until yeah. they did that reprint but if you were running those types of decks you had to have it yeah Whereas a rotate format is like, well, I can pretty much get hold of these cards yeah. because they will be, they well, will exist. And, and that that is the big benefit to that as well. Like, but I, I don't know when when we did the set review mm -hmm. the, the other day. Like, it, it, there's a lot in there that's like, there's a lot of life in older decks. And you say that it's felt mostly the same, but like, you know, how we had two water lightning wins. Well, no, I suppose didn't win it came to the top table in, in mm. but that was the same so two on, on, four, on two yeah. point different lists as well. Yeah. You know. But like water lightning, we haven't seen in quite some time because of all the life that the F of eight dredge stuff gave to it. Like, well, ice lightning took the whole thing, which people were writing off as it wasn't a viable deck in this. That's format. it. Twenty one was a big gigawall format, mm -hmm. and like as, as much as it's a deck that I played for a lot in this one, like you know, the, I, I I stopped on that because you know felt massively solved. Mono Earth Rainbow has been a huge thing, <laughs> so you know, obviously it's got that one deck that seems to be eternal and keeps getting format, but like. And obviously, Refi is not going anywhere because she's got a full art coming out in 23. Um, but maybe that's not the problem. But Warrior of Light is just... Man, get rid of it. Like It, it is problematic at this point. If they, if, they, if they want their legends to stay in this, so only put it to one, that is fine. But like, there is a lot of legends in that deck. <laughs> like, oh, yeah. I mean, I, again, I think that like Sophie, Sophie being limited to one is is more enough like precedence to set wall to one as well um like it, it eff effectively does the same thing because it has haste it's mm. still initially you play it a turn you get a damage and you get a draw the thing is because they don't have to commit to either you can put something on there see how it goes and you you can roll them back uh, do, do you know actually it, it's funny you say that because one of the things that we really noticed like one of the things where they banned sophie uh, was like yeah, because um Ursula would always be like, well, sack everything when you try to chant out. It doesn't actually get removed again and break zone. Yep. Well, uh, which of the fans does that? <laughs> yeah. You want to play Neo X Death? Oh, cool. I'm going to kill your Neo X Death on the stack with my three monsters. Uh, and I'm also going to kill my own Witch of the Fens. So, so they're yeah. all in the break zone and not removed from game. Yeah, right. <laughs> well, to, to be fair, like I, uh, even for me, like I used to play Ursula so wrong. I thought that it was like she could target everything else, not herself. Mm. But the fact that I learned like six sets too late that you could actually shoot her as well I'm like I'm an idiot yeah. <laughs> could I count her around longer <laughs> yeah but well there's no shame in bands that's, no. that's, that's the thing I want to get across there's no shame in it and like and also like admitting that you've made mistakes it's fine you know like it, the game is, is you for that. the game is really well balanced and you know for mistakes that it's made I, I, do, multi element cards are a mistake 100% <laughs> I'll completely go for that they do too much they cost too little and you can cheat them in, which is ridiculous. You should never have been able to do that. They've got no restrictions. They should have them ban all multi element cards. <laughs> also, LB is problematic. Um, it's a little bit samey because it goes, you know, but th there is stuff that, that, that mitigates a lot of that stuff now, I think. It's having like Porum live on turn one is a big thing. So, you know, yeah. it, it's, there are, there are mitigations to that, I think. Just to see how it goes with the next set, I guess. Yeah, the, definitely. Well, it's, it's open mind, I guess, with that. So. Yeah, that's it. Well, guys, um, again, we will try and bring you Connor's deck. We're just hopefully going to try and find another one. So stick with us. If not, we'll back up the sign up. We'll back up the show.